Hey everybody, this is Troy from the Do-It-Yourself World and the Off-Grid Project. We got a very large box came in the mail today. And this is from a company called Big Battery. So let's see what we got here. Let me get out a knife, I'll be right back. Pack well. Definitely packed well. Like Christmas. Yeah, right. So we got a very large box here, a lot of packing material, oh, there's a couple things in here, let's see what we got, oh wow, this box is loaded with stuff, let me see, I'll get everything out on the table first, there's a whole mess of things in here. Uh. Oh, weird, what's that? Look at that, there's a little LED beep and blinking on it. This box is loaded. So, I'll just be laying things down here as I pull them out, guys. You can see everything as I go. Let's slide this over soon because there's another big thing in here. I miss this to show a company. Yeah, this is a, a company called Big Battery that uh, reached out to me, and I'll be explaining some details in a minute here. Let me get the packing material off the table. That is heavy. So, I'll start, as you said, it's like Christmas. We'll start with the little stuff and say the best and biggest for last, right? Yep. That's how I always do it. That's fun. Actually, this is um, interesting. Since this has got an actual retail packing, and I can see what we got, 300 watt portable power station. That looks really nice. It's got a nice picture on the side too. Let me see, 110 volts on off switch, LCD battery percentage indicator, two USB ports, two AC power outlets. So this, guys, I'm going to go over in fine detail. I knew this was coming. I'm not sure what else, anything else is here. I knew this was coming, and I'm going to be doing a full product video on this and review because this is a very high-quality portable power unit. Beautiful, too. Very nice looking. So there's your... Power cable, plug goes in here, and it's got a solar um, DC input from 42 to 60 volts input at maximum 2 amps. So it's AC chargeable and solar chargeable. That is great for emergency power backups or for off-grid living or camping, bugging out, survival, to have power on the go. Yeah, that is that. really neat. Oh, look at that. There's a full um, color indicator, multicolor indicator on your, your charge status, plus a digital display. See that, Chris? Ooh. That's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it is. That's really neat. So a bar graph indicator and digital display. We'll come back to this in full later. That's one device. We got a box here. Oh, look at that, Chris. Ooh, well, you can 650 by looks of things. I think these are bigger. These are 3.7 volt, um, 5,000 milliamp, 18 and a half watt hours. Um, it's a little bit bigger. I forgot. I got to look up the number on it. There, it's a NCR 21700. Yeah. I got to look up the model number on that because I don't want to lie to you. That's a different size battery. There's, like, like I said, that's 18 and a half watt hours. 
So 5,000 milliamp hours, that's a lot of power. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. So there's 25 of these with a nice convenient holder. So these are exactly pretty much what they say on it. These are Model 3 2170 single cells. Now these were reclaimed, hardly used, tested, and 100% guaranteed. So those are going to be awesome to be experimenting with on um, power banks. So there's going to be a lot of stuff going on. I'm going to be sharing some of this on my tactical channel, some of it on my electronics channel. I hope the wind charms don't bother you, it's sort of windy out. Some of this stuff I'll be sharing on my main channel. And we got here a, oh, okay, I know what this one is. This is going to be fun, too. Here we have a little battery pack with those same batteries in it and a BMS controller. This is going to be fun for the uh, um, e-bikes. This little uh, e-bike battery pack with your controller all together. So I'll probably be working with that on the electronics channel in uh, very much detail. Now this one here is a 24 volt battery pack which contains seven of the Model 3 2170 single cells, each at 5,000 milliamp hours. This gives you a battery pack at 24 volts and about 130 watt hours of power. So with the BMS included, this is a plug and play solution right there. So that can be the, the center of a portable power bank. Emergency power, scooter power. I've got a scooter I might try that on. It's a 24 volt scooter. That would be fun to try that out. Now let's go to the one that's sitting here blinking. Let's see what this is. Oh! Okay, that's a bigger battery bank. All neatly done and ready to go. There's your power connections. It's all packed. What do we got? Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. 18650s by the look of it. Yep. Very nice power bank. Very, very well put together. Control circuitry. Neatly packaged. Ready to use. Yeah, very like nice. That. Very nice. This one here is a complete, actually commercially made battery pack from a uh, electric scooter and they're certified guaranteed like new condition with uh, about 90 percent of their power most of them were never used or if so very little used and so there you have a plug-and-play scooter battery pack this is a 36 volt battery pack with 20 18650s in it and a plug that you can use or swap out as needed and uh, it's about a five point something amp hour battery pack so right there is a full plug and play solution for your scooter and that's pretty cool I've got a scooter I want to try that on too now save the best for last right yep exactly Let's see what we got here there's everything good overview So big battery is a major uh, battery recycling center and they actually make their own products. So they have anything from forklift battery banks to golf cart battery banks to uh, off-grid power storage, e-bike battery packs, individual battery packs like the... Uh, the, the individual batteries, lithium-ion batteries. They have power walls for off-grid living. So 
So I'm not even sure what we got here until I get it open. And their prices are honestly the lowest out there. And I did a lot of research on their company and price comparisons. And uh, they've got the best prices out there on the market that I have seen. And I'm going to be sharing some links later on and uh, doing some videos on their company and their products. Oh, look at that, Chris. You will help this up. I like that. That is heavy. So what do we have here? All right, pull it out, please. What do we have here? There's an output. Okay. Look at that. So we have a, this is going to require a lot bigger space than what I've got here. This folds open. It's all hinged. Yeah. And we have four solar panels. Very, very nice. Um, I don't see the specs, so I'm going to have to look this up. There's four big solar panels here. They're heavy. Yeah. So, and they're, they've got one combined output right here. And that actually looks oh, like nice. the same type of plug. Yeah. That, so I'm going to have to ask them. I don't know what the voltage is. I can, I can check it out in the sunlight. But that's the same type of plugs that they've got on their, their, some of their things here. Yeah. See, there's another one. See that? Yeah. So they've got everything set up with that uh, the plug, and then they got their own solar panels. So this folding solar panel is matched with this portable power station. So this is about 40, probably I'm going to have to measure it later on. This is designed to take uh, solar input 40 to 60 volts at 2 amps max. So I'm guessing that this is going to be somewhere in that range, 40 to 60 volts, 2 amps output, and uh, in, in four individual solar panels. So there you have a full, completely matched mobile power unit for off-grid survival or backup power. This can power any of your devices for, a, well, depending on how much power it draws for a brief period, but it'll keep your phones charged up, it'll keep your laptop going briefly, and uh, tablets certainly, but we'll go over all that in detail in a separate video. All right, guys, well, I'll be doing a lot of videos on this stuff later, like I said, so um, meanwhile, I'll put some links down below for anybody interested. Stay tuned for all the updates and the uh, reviews. I hope you are as excited as I am. I know a lot of people will be. This is Troy from the Do-It-Yourself World and the Off-Grid Project. A lot of cool videos to come. Talk to you later.